Rather than repeat what so many scientists have already done over the past 20 or more years, and sit here and examine every claim made by people who've tried to link vaccines to autism, it makes more sense to zoom out and ask, is this even a realistic question? It never made sense to me how something like a vaccine could uh, ever be responsible for so many global uh, alterations. I couldn't even imagine a plausible mechanism. It's not just the evidence that vaccines don't cause autism. It just makes no sense. We've learned so much about the um, aut how autism spectrum disorder disorder occurs in early fetal brain development through the action of autism genes. And in fact, if anything, there's some studies to suggest that vaccination may even protect against some forms of autism. For instance, we know congenital rubella syndrome, um, which causes multiple birth defects, including an autism phenotype. In that case, getting the MMR vaccine as a kid will protect in a sense, will protect your child against autism later in life. We keep mentioning this in this episode, how difficult it can be to untangle all of these things in the environment from those harder to see genetic causes. 